is Nigel Farage. He's organised a huge Brexit celebration to mark this great occasion. Take your victory lap, Nigel. Yeah, they're congregating already, as Ashley has said. Um, I've seen people for the last few hours gathering in big party mood. And yes, Union Jacks. And do you know why? That's our national flag. We don't want the European Star Spangled Banner. We don't want their anthem. We don't want their president. We don't want their police force, their army. We, in six hours' time, are going to be free of it. And it is because of that. This is the greatest day in modern British history. It's okay. that big. Nigel, I've got to refer you to this headline in the New York Times, the business section. I'll read it for you. Brexit mm. is finally happening. Now things are going to get really complicated. OK. The elites don't like this. What's your point of view? No, of course, there'll always be those that try to uh, make things difficult for us. Look, what happens at 11 o'clock UK time tonight is we pass the point of no return. We are leaving this political union. We will never, ever go back. Sure, there's detail to sort out, and yes, it matters. But we now go into this next phase with a renewed confidence about who we are, about our friends around the world, of course, including the USA, and yet the globalists like the New York Times or CNN or all these people, they will always try and make out that it's difficult. But I'm already sensing, just a month into this year, a new sense of optimism in this country, a new belief that we can govern ourselves, be a great people and reach out to our friends. And I, I've never felt more bullish about Britain than I feel right now. How long will it take to get a trade deal with America? Well, that depends a bit on what happens with the European negotiations. I mean, remember that Australia negotiated a deal with America ten months end-to-end -end of hard negotiations. So all these lies we get that it takes ten years to do a trade deal, it's all rubbish. Everything in life is about will. If you want to do things, you can do them. We like the sound of that, Mr Farage, and we're very glad that you've been with us all these years, right from the initial uh, referendum all the way back. Yeah. Congratulations, Nigel. You helped pull Thank this you, thing off. Congratulations, Thank India, you. and to all the Brits. Nigel Farage, everyone, good man. Thank you very much.